It's a psychological drama about family, trust, and our relationship to social media. And it's from the perspective of the parents, which is uh, quite a, a terrifying thing for Diane David, because with social media and to- technology, they know less about it than, than their teenage son does. Um, so how do they keep him safe? How do they protect him in a world where they're kind of on the back foot all the way through? It is Di's story. She is a mother and a wife and kind of an every woman. And that's the beauty of it is because I think this story could happen to anyone. So she's representative of wives and mothers everywhere. Uh, And she's kind of the one that wants to find out the truth because she wants to solve it because she's a just and good person is essentially how I'd sum die up. When we see Cara, she's gone through quite a bit and she's quite a feisty character um, and she's quite smart and strong and she stands for what she believes in. Um, but yeah, throughout four minutes and 12 seconds, she kind of, it's a bit of a journey for her and what you see with in the audience, from the audience's perspective is um, short bursts of her kind of dealing with what's gone on in, during the play. I play David, who is the father of Jack, who is a 17-year-old boy who has been accused of uploading a sex tape to the internet. And Nick is Jack's best friend, and he is also best friends with Cara as well. So um, he's dropped into the middle of this scandal, so it's interesting to see where he stands in, in the midst of that, with obviously with it involving his two friends. It's really interesting that it's from their perspective and we really follow Di and David on this journey as they sort of overcome obstacle after obstacle and realisation after realisation and it's, you just kind of get buffered around with them as we watch them go through it. We started with the idea of uh, the family home because that's where um, most of the scenes take place in um, Di's house and we looked at the ways in which uh, the family home could be made strange uh, and alien Um, so we've gone for quite a stylized depiction of a house and we wanted to look at ways of like shutting down the space because the stage the Oldham Coliseum stage is obviously very large um, and the story that's being told is quite intimate and um, personal and there are very rarely more than like one person one person and one other person on stage at the same time Um, so we looked at ways of shutting down the space uh, in order to create a sense of sort of claustrophobia. I think it's sort of a, a, a relevant look at uh, family, at relationships, at marriage, um, at the world um, from a generational point of view as well as sort of w- within a family unit. We want them to feel like they they're constantly trying to work it out and they want to know what happens next and it should it should feel like a surprise every new scene should feel like we're gathering bits of information um so you should feel like active in your viewing trying to work this out with us as we're watching it and for me anyway it's made me reflective on how much of your life that you actually put out there on social media and obviously with the whole thing centering around that it's made you think that like it's made you go back and reflect on what it is that you put on social media and the impact that it has when it's used for the wrong things. Because it's told from so many different people's perspectives and what they think their truth is. I think it's always like, you're always like, oh, so is that the truth or is that the truth? So I recently became a dad for the first time. Three weeks ago, Finian was born. And when this was programmed, I didn't know I was gonna be a dad. So yeah, it has (laughs) changed my perspective uh, slightly, I think, kind of uh, having those strong feelings of love and protection for my son and my family Um, and now going into this text and this play in this world and really feeling for Diane David in in a little a deeper way perhaps. I'm going to say it's a journey. Generational difference, um, uh, relevance, relationships, engaging, relevance, uh, challenging, gritty, intense, mind blowing, 
tense, emotional, revealing, and it's shocking. This play, I think, can be enjoyed by literally everyone. I think you can sit in the audience and have this shared experience with people of all different ages, um, and it would it will feel like a roller coaster ride. I think you'll strap in at the start, and this play just never lets you go. I think the twists and turns, the emotional journey, and I can't wait to to see the audiences and just hear all the different perspectives on what is happening and how people relate to this and how people make their judgments on it. I think it's a real uh, a real conversation starter.